welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be reviewing Abigail. Um, I really liked this movie. Um, I didn't love it, but I really liked it. It was a fun time. Um, so essentially, Abigail um, is about a vampire ballerina who eats a bunch of adults. Um, they're trapped in Dracula's house, her house. Um, and they're stuck there, and they're trying to escape, and meanwhile, she's picking them off one by one. Um, so, I love vampire movies, so I was all in, um, and it had a couple of my favorite actors, so I was just like, yeah, let's do it. Um, and I was thoroughly surprised with what the plot of this movie was so the movie starts out um they're kidnapping this little girl who ends up turning out to be abigail um and they essentially are kidnapping her and then they're going to the plan is to uh, blackmail the dad who is apparently very rich but they don't know who he is they just know he's a rich individual and they are going to in turn get money from him and then release the child um, and split it amongst each other. But these individuals are being hired by a higher authority um, that they don't know. They kind of know like the middleman. Um, and basically, they don't know each other's identities. Um, they were picked um, for their um talents and unique abilities there's one who's like super tech savvy um another one who's like for the muscle and stuff like that um and so they also like are people that want the money and everything they're not like people who do this on the daily um they're regular people who like chose to do this i don't know how they did but yeah they kidnap this little ballerina take her to this house in the middle of nowhere um and then uh, they're supposed to wait until they hear from the father who they don't know who it is um which didn't make sense to me but okay um this whole thing is like super top secret um and then they discover that they are trapped in the house like it is locked and then all the windows start closing and everything ends up gated and everything it they like trigger something and now everything like windows and everything is locked um and they were like oh somebody like two time does like there has to be an inside guy who works for the dad they think this dad is like this horrible person which it is like this super rich horrible person um but he ends up being dracula um and apparently his daughter ends up being like this assassin kind of person that they say oh it's this you know well-trained assassin his name is this and blah, blah blah this and they say this about him um but nobody has actually seen him and it's this little girl so apparently she's stronger than Dracula or he sets her out on the missions but she like literally does everything he says and they're basically thinking that it's one of the people inside and uh, with them that is in on it um and then they think it's like the middle guy who like hired someone and then apparently there's one of them who knows the middle guy so and they've done more jobs so i think he's the only one that's done multiple jobs i'm not sure um but one of the girls um she kind of reveals like her face to abigail because she kind of like because at first abigail like is acting like what's going on you know they like sedate her um at first and then she wakes up and she's like freaking out and everything but this little girl like obviously is playing them um and she and her father are the ones who lock them in the house and hire them um it turns out um and the middleman turns out also isn't on it because he's also a vampire um 
And the way that you make a vampire, it's so complicated. Like, there's one of the girls, she gets bit. And TikTok spoiled this for me way earlier than I will would have liked I, I hadn't watched the movie yet um and she gets turned into a vampire when Ab abigail does like this ritual dance thing and she like essentially is like controlling her and is her and that's how she turns into a vampire like it's very weird um eventually she reveals herself to them and they play this game of cat and mouse um and she plays tricks on them and it's like they trap her and she's like i can get out blah blah this blah blah that. the only thing that works is the sedation um so they form this plan they try to sedate her and they put her in a cage and she can get out of the cage and it's, it's like they, it was for nothing basically but they're just trying to outrun her and get out of the house and essentially one of them is going to get out of the house and we kind of know at this point that it's going to be that lady um who like wants you know to get back to her son and that's why she kind of bonded with abigail because she knows what it's like you know not to have family and abigail wants kind of the reassurance from her father and everything and there's this like romance between like one of the guys and this like main girl and i'm like they don't know each other prior to this they act like they know each other like him and that girl um and he's like we're gonna get out of this together and everything like i guess they're just like both like they know that this is like not something that they're meant to be doing um and like they're just doing it just because and they're very smart and i think that's why but it came off as like romantic i don't know um they all come up with like different names that they call each other throughout the movie even when they find out who each other are and abigail knows who each of them are is um obviously because she looked into their background and each of them has um a background that messed up something for her father because her father is also like a really big you know rich businessman guy at the end there's this the psychotic guy who is driving me crazy he's like all over the place but then he's also like power hungry um he gets turned into a vampire kills the guy who's the middle guy who was his friend which is not his friend but it was like they do business together it kills him so that way he can be the only one in power um and then in turn he tries to turn the other girl to do his bidding to kill abigail abigail is like that's not how it works um you haven't had enough time to be a vampire to like figure out the whole possession thing um and like he figures out a lot of things fairly quick he starts like flying and doing stuff and that's the one thing he can't do like i don't understand um and then dracula comes he wants to kill the girl and she's like no she saved me and blah blah this and um because her and abigail in the end work together to kill the guy and so such and then she's like am i gonna turn into a vampire because that's how the other girl and he's like no the guy who bit you is dead go and find your son and blah blah and she escapes and it's just a very interesting movie but it was a, it was a ride it was it was it was a time i got confused in some parts other parts i was just like this is pure entertainment for me um and other parts i was very like into it um it was just a roller coaster of a movie for me. Um, but yeah, that's my review. Um, um, so thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you real soon. Bye!